denary to binary conversion there are two methods to convert a denary number to its binary representation the first method is trial and error while the second method involves the successive division of the number by 2 let's understand both methods with an example let's take a denary number 107 Method one, trial and error. This method involves placing one and zero at correct places so that the sum equals the denary value. Do not feel confused with the numbers that you see on the screen. They represent two raised to the power x. On your uh, right hand side, you can see two raised to the power zero's value. and moving towards your left hand side you can see 2 raised to the power 7's value that is 128 the binary number representation contains 8 bits that is a standard format therefore we have used 2 raised to the power 0 till 2 raised to the power 7 consider this these 8 values as 8 switches these switches can either be on or off that is they can have a value of 1 or 0 we will find out the value of 107's binary by keeping this concept in our mind now starting from our left hand side we will start turning on the switches we have seen the switch 128 the value is greater than 107 so this switch needs to be off then we move to 64 the value is less than 107 so we will turn on the switch then we will move forward to 32 64 plus 32 makes 96 which is still less than 107 so we will turn on 32 however if we add 16 into 96 it will make 112 which is greater than 107 so this switch needs to be off we will then check switch with value 8 add it add the value to 96 it makes 104 which is less than 107 so we will turn on switch with value 8 we will then check switch with value 4 2 and 1 to check if you have converted the denary value to its correct binary representation Ignore the off switches and add together the on values to verify your result. 64 plus 32 plus 8 plus 2 plus 1 gives you 107, which means you have converted it the correct way. We will now see successive division method. For simplicity, we are taking the same number. We will take the value 107 and divide it with 2 again and again until the value becomes 0. We divided 107 by 2 it gave us 53 and remainder 1 53 divided by 2 gave us 26 and remainder 1 26 divided by 2 gave us 13 and remainder 0 13 divided by 2 gave us 6 and remainder 1 6 divided by 2 gave us 3 and remainder 0 3 divided by 2 gave us 1 and remainder 1 1 divided by 2 gave us 0 and remainder 1 Now to find out the binary representation read remainders from bottom to up. Reading remainder from bottom to up gives us 1101011 which is 7 bits. To make it an 8 bit number we will add 0 on the left hand side. If you like this video don't forget to like us on Facebook, follow us on Instagram and LinkedIn and subscribe to our YouTube channel.